So one of the things that I always liked the best about living in this place that I'm currently living in is that there was always peace and quiet and it was like in a more secluded area. I mean, we're still within city limits, but we were more like farther out, like behind where we lived, there used to be a golf course. So it was like kind of secluded. Um, we aren't far from the highway, but um, now we have all of this crap. And now I'm gonna take you outside and I'm gonna show you what we're dealing with now. So hold on a second, because I also have to fix the solar lights. You see that little black thing, I have to switch it around. All of this crap. Oh wow, the gutters are falling off of that end apartment building over there, if you can see that, but it used to be so quiet and peaceful over here, and now we have to deal with this crap. And they're like building this whole little subdivision over here. It used to be really peaceful in that little pond over there, but now there's all these little houses and I would just rather go back to my own little peaceful oasis, but I guess it's part of the urbanization of America. But, um, anyways, I guess I'll go back inside. Um, I went to the chiropractor today, as usual, because like I said, I go see them three, day, three times a week and um this was the first time for this week today's only monday um and she taped my neck i don't know if you can really see that very well but um she put kinesiology tape on my neck and it's really driving me nuts um but basically i have to leave that on there for five to seven days last week she taped my lower back but she said that my muscles in my neck and my upper back were really swollen last week, so she wanted to tape my upper back and my neck, but she really only taped, like, my neck. Um, so yeah. Uh, this week I am still off of work, and I have to go do my echo and everything on Friday. It's Monday, though, so that's not going to be for a while. Tomorrow is dialysis and all of that, and I just feel like my life is still spiraling out of control. And I don't know how to fix it, um, so I'm still trying to figure things out in that regard. I'm trying to figure out if uh, I need to move, if we're going to be moving. I don't know, possibly, but um, I don't know. It's just a lot going on right now because yeah, such is life. But how about this? So it is February. And it's like in the 50s right now. Um, I think when I went outside, it was like 53 degrees. Um, I'm not talking about when I just went out on the patio to show you guys that. I actually just walked up to the mailbox. And because um, my mom sent a package, um, a little care package for Paul um, with some goodies that he can eat um, that works with his kidney diet. Um, <clears throat> so like... I just went up there to check the mail and see if it had come yet, and it hadn't. Um, but it was like 50-something degrees, and that's crazy for February in northwest Indiana. Um, but anyways, I guess I just wanted to show you guys the urbanization of our no longer peaceful little neighborhood. Um, if you guys remember, last year when we moved into this apartment, it was all like, none of these houses were here none of these houses were here like they were building this one over here i think this one they were building that one when we got here 
and then they built this one and then they were building those back there and now there's a whole bunch of them but um anyways i don't know i digress but i hope you guys are having a great day and um let me know what you think do you think that it's wrong to want to be in a quiet neighborhood um do you think that the quiet neighborhoods are just going to keep disappearing um I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.